Hey, it's Joseph here. Today I have a package to open because I received this package from StarTech a while back, but I haven't been able to open it since I wanted to unbox and introduce what this product is to you guys. So first, let's just look at the packaging since it's gonna highlight the features and the specifications. So it is a Thunderbolt 3 dock with USB-C laptop compatibility dual 4k display port with 16 watts of power delivery turn your thunderbolt 3 or usb-c equipped laptop into dual monitor workstation adding five usb ports plus power and charging i guess that's a product picture here and another one here in order to use this product you're gonna have to have a laptop that has thunderbolt 3 perhaps a power delivery but that is not required and i actually have a laptop on hand to test this out because it has a thunderbolt 3 which is one right here but it is not going to utilize power delivery because this laptop does not charge via thunderbolt so i'll use this laptop to test out whether the thunderbolt is actually working as it is supposed to but i don't expect this laptop to be charged however if it is indeed power delivery of 60 watts then i can actually charge my surface pro 4 which is one right here it has a little dongle and as long as you put more than 60 watts of power delivery in here then it just converts out to surface connect that is what i'm about to test in this video so let's get this box opened so we've got a manual that shows what ports are where and what they do and we are greeted with something like this oh it is much lighter than I thought it would be. It's quite light. Okay, let's see what other things are in here. Cables, cables, more cables and a charging brick. So the total weight of this, maybe even like the weight of these three cables is about the same as this dock. Interesting. And the charging brick is obviously a lot heavier. So I've got this charging brick just like the laptop charger kind. And then this is USB-C to USB-C, Thunderbolt 3. So not really long, I would say about two feet. As long as this sits on your desk, that's all you need, right? And then I've got this, oh, I guess this is for a different country. So this is a US plug. I just need to undo these ties. And conveniently, I do have a power outlet on my desk. And then I can just connect this to the charging brick. I guess that goes on to this portion. So on the bottom, it's kind of got some dust on it, but it's rubberized, so I suppose it doesn't move around as easily. I have the camera focus, so that's what it looks like. Pretty nice. And on the top, it simply states StarTech. So I guess this shows the most amount of ports that's on this unit. Okay, I did grab the thumbnails for this video. So starting from the left, there is an ethernet port and then five gigabits per second USB. I am guessing that is the USB 3.2 Gen 2, something like that. And there is 10 gigabits of USB-C, another 10 gigabits with USB-C but it also has power delivery with the battery charging icon there. And then video one, which is a display port, video two display port, and then there's the barrel plug for the charger. And then I guess this is the front. And then the front, it has a headphone jack, 10 gigabits charging as well. Oh, I guess the charging icon is for continued power. So basically you can keep things charged, even though that your computer is not connected up, it will still power through that port. Those two ports with the battery charging icon, I guess it is continued power. And then the main thing, the Thunderbolt uh, USB-C port that is on the front like that. And it has a little LED indicator that shows, I guess, connected or not. And on the side, there's a Kensington lock. I guess people do care about the security so you can actually lock this dock up so that people can't really steal it. And 
there is a little screw also available at the bottom so if you want i guess you can just kind of mount this in some way too i don't have that mounting system so i'm just gonna rest it on my desk and see how it goes so this thunderbolt 3 cable is gonna go on the front i suppose it's gonna be very high grade ensuring the data transfer and power delivery and then this thing is going to plug into the back of the dock and i see the front indicator the led here lighting up and since the only thing that's been connected to this dock is charging so let's test out my surface floor first because we can test power delivery with that so anything lower than 60 watts of power delivery the surface will not charge simply it just doesn't it's kind of frustrating i suppose maybe more recent surface pro like surface pro 7 might do better but surface pro 4 never had power delivery system and it only charged with this surface connect so this is a little dongle that you can get for about 10 bucks and then you can connect to any power delivery port that has more than 60 watts and it will charge let's see so on the side at least it indicates that it is charging let's confirm that on the laptop so this port if i disconnect it's gonna go 100 percent but it is not charging yet if i go ahead and connect this port it shows up as charging so yeah power delivery 60 watts confirmed all right, let's move on to the other bits of Thunderbolt, whether it pushes out 4K displays via display ports, I don't know. So let's test that out. So first, get the laptop, connect to the USB-C Thunderbolt port. So here I have one cable that's coming from my big screen. It's actually 5K screen, I believe it is. 5 120 by 2160 it is that big wide monitor from msi which i also featured on the channel if you haven't seen that video do check it out but i'm trying to connect that monitor onto this dock and see how it works using the thunderbolt so i'm just going to connect into video one and let me show you what i'm seeing with my phone camera so from this laptop it is going to USB C, goes to the dock which is a Thunderbolt port and then the display goes to the screen. So if you look here, let's go to display settings and then it's gonna show two different screens and then identify, so you see one and two. So one is right here and then two, apply. Now I can just take this screen up to there so this one we're seeing at 200% resolution, but what about this 5K screen? So can I, yeah, so as you can see here, it is listed as 5120 by 2160. So that is effectively 5K screen that is fed with one single cable. So yeah, if you have other peripherals, that you would like to connect via those other ports, then you can certainly do so. You can connect USB-C. Let's actually test that, shall we? So I actually have this 360 camera that connects via USB-C. So USB-C, USB-C. Let's see if it charges up from the back. And I'm gonna connect to the charging port. Yep, it is powering up. And let's connect some other ones. So here's actually a battery bank, which I would like to connect and then charge onto the front of the dock, confirm that it is charging. And then I have this external drive that has USB-C port and then connect that one there and then this end onto the back of the dock and see if it reads on the laptop. So there it is. There is that drive connected, which I can disconnect and then it will go away. Right now it's got four different ports and it's still working. All right, so let's test the continued charging. As soon as I unplug, that should kind of disconnect and my screen is going away as well. But are the other devices connected to the continued charging port going to charge? Yes, you can see the light coming on. It's not connect, this side is not connected to the laptop, but it is still charging. And this one, 
as well. This one's charging as well. So as long as you connect to the continued ports, it's gonna continue charging. I think that's how they call it. Yeah, there is that short testing of this dock. It's connected to everywhere right now, but I suppose you can tuck away some of the cables, unlike I did, and then have that sleek looking, very clean desktop. Everything is on the back so that you have one cable that is coming out from the port and then one cable solution onto your desktop. So I would use this dock in the office and you just have this dock set up and all the monitors are all hooked up on here. And then you just arrive to the office, lay your laptop down, connect your one single port onto the laptop and then it's gonna charge your laptop given that it's gonna utilize power delivery of 60 watts and then it's gonna connect all the peripherals that you have connected into. And if you need to go, you just disconnect one port and then get going with your laptop. Sounds like an easy solution. I hope that was useful to you. If you liked it, please like and subscribe to my channel if you want to continue watching these type of videos. Thank you so much for watching as always. I'll see you next time. Bye.